Okay, so the future of technology and education. All right, well, so working at SIS, I think I've been able to go further than I ever imagined with technology in a school setting. We're, we're an open platform. We brought in iPads. We start one-to-one -one grade four. Um, we don't tell teachers you have to use these specific things, and we try to get a lot of freedom. And as an administrator, as an administrator I'll be honest, it still scares me sometimes. And there's a little bit of that control that, you know, a parent comes in and I can't say, well, we're using Google Apps and, and, and WordPress and we're using those for this, this, and this, where the conversation I have to have is I need to start with why we're using it. And the tools that we're using are really, I don't want to say they're irrelevant, but that's not what, what I want to talk about. I want to talk about why we're using the technology. We're using it to give, to personalize education. We're using it to, to make it easier to differentiate. Um, we're using it to, to help prepare kids for you know, the world that they're going to enter in. And I think that's what we have to stay focused on rather than the devices, because the reality is, yeah, we're using iPads today. I would be shocked if the school that I'm at right now is using iPads five years from now. Um, I think it's going to be different. Um, we've learned that a computer lab, there's a, there is some need for a computer lab, but we really haven't needed it for the last three years. We've found other ways to be able to work around those issues and those problems. So um, I don't know. I think it's exciting thinking about what the future of technology is and what that's going to look like in in schools and how it's going to look different in different places. But I think the key thing that I need to keep myself focused on, because as an administrator, you, you, you want to make sure everything works and you want to make sure that you have all the nuts and bolts down, but I have to stop thinking about the device, the iPhone, the tablet, the, 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 the laptop, whatever it is. I need to stop thinking about that and I always need to go back to why when, when I'm talking with parents and when I'm talking with teachers. Because otherwise, teachers just want as many devices as they can get. Parents just want to know what to buy their kids and to make sure that they're doing the right thing. But technology is going to change so fast, we can't focus on that. We have to focus on why we're doing it and make sure whatever, what, whatever we have in our schools, that it's pointing towards, towards that mission, towards that belief, to, towards what we want to help our kids accomplish.